my name is Erica Turner and I'm a therapist here at Conversations Off the Couch, which is in the events arm of Group Therapy Associates. Um, and I wanted to talk to you a little bit today about why we do some of the events that we do. Um, if you've been following us on pretty much any platform, so Face Grant, Face, Face Grant, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, uh, any of that. Um, I'm sure you've seen some information about our events for couples and for singles. Um, and we're trying to do a bit of a better job explaining why we do those events. Um, and the reason, or one of the reasons, um, well, one of the reasons is just that we like to have fun. Um, and we enjoy talking about relationships with people. We enjoy talking about how relationships come together and how to make them work better and how to make them more satisfying. Um, that's our thing as couples therapists. Um, the other piece, and of course the more important piece than our own enjoyment, um, is that as a therapist there are times when you have clients, particularly couples, who come in and they work with you and you're doing great work and everything is good. Um, and they'll have this moment when they say, you know, I wish we had come in sooner. I wish we had come in before it had gotten this bad. I wish we had come in before we were thinking about divorce or separation um, or before it just got so, you know, we got so far apart. I wish we had, we had come in before then. And, um, you know, as a therapist, you can't help but want to get on the front end of that a little bit. Um, and that extends with all of our clients, I think, but particularly with couples and individuals who are working on relationship issues because it can be so easy to keep getting in the same pattern. You know, if you're single, to keep dating that person over and over again who's unavailable or not able to give you what you need or, um, you know, just isn't a good fit for you. Um, and we are firm believers in empowering people to make choices about their relationships, to have the information that you need about what a healthy relationship is, how to maintain a healthy relationship um, in order to be successful and to recognize when something isn't working, um, when something isn't what you need or what you want, um, and to understand what's possible too. I mean, certainly we sometimes have unrealistic expectations about relationships and what's really possible. Um, so, you know, we're all about sort of helping people on the front end. Um, I guess we're about putting ourselves out of business a little bit because we're putting, giving you the information on the front end and then you're never really having to come to us on the back end. Um, yeah, didn't think that through. Um, but no, seriously, it's, you know, you want to be helpful on the front end. And also you want people to recognize when there is a problem that, you know, would be worth seeking the help of a professional like ourselves or, you know, like a pastor or um, someone else who deals with relationship issues. Um, so it's, it's helpful to know that before you've gotten too far down that road. Um, so that's a little bit about why we do what we do. We'd love to hear your thoughts about that or any questions that you have about that. Um, you can email us at therapy at grouptherapyassociates.com. You can tweet us. You can find us on Instagram, Facebook, Pinterest. Um, if you are within a mile of a social media platform, we are there. Not Snapchat. I haven't gotten there yet. That may not happen. Um, but yeah, please check us out and we'd love to hear again, your thoughts, your feedback, your comments. Thanks.